So I grabbed this uh, sunlight maggot for a very specific purpose. I don't want to use a, uh, an item that will take up my shield slot. Yes, I killed Solaire because I was lazy. But mostly because I don't want to get rid of... Uh, come on. Mostly because I don't want to get rid of my... Uh, my stamina regen. So remember this whole area from the beginning of the let's play? Yeah, we're actually going to run through it this time. So, the one thing that a lot of people don't like about this area is the skeletons and they're there's a lot of them but if you kill the necromancers they don't become too big of a nuisance which is nice all right stop stop prioritizing loot There's another necromancer somewhere around here. Might be mistaken. There's definitely a necromancer somewhere around here. I know where it is. It's just <laughs> Hello. How are you? Okay, what do I want to do? I don't really explore this area too often. I've only really done it recently for purposes of Let's Play. There is a number of things I do know of. Okay, that is a trap. But you can avoid it sneakily. Oh yeah, something... Uh, Regarding the skeletons, you don't need to kill the necromancer if you have a divine weapon. If uh, you use a divine or cursed weapon, I believe you need it's oh. an occult. An occult club does work as well, I believe. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Oh jeez, I almost died. Oh shit, necromancers. Forgot. How did I forget? Okay. Before I do something stupid again. Okay, where is it? Where is it? I'm gonna go grab a great scythe. I <laughs> great scythe is uh oh yeah that's a door. Great scythe is my well I wouldn't say favorite weapon, but it is nice to have. So I'm gonna push this in. Actually, pretty good, I will say.
Okay, so this is something a lot of you probably didn't know. See this suspicious looking wall? Fake wall. And even better, bonfire. Oh, you didn't know that? <laughs> I know you didn't know that. Except for you. I knew you knew. See, it totally pays off to explore. But I can understand if uh, you didn't want to explore this area. Because nobody does. Isn't that right? Person who is supposed to be here. Okay, never mind. So for the time being, I'm actually just going to continue exploring. Because I kind of owe it after skipping out on so much of Lost Isleth. So, if you're daring, you can completely screw that up. <laughs> oh, no. Try this again. If you are daring, you can jump down here, down there, and... Okay. Don't quite jump down that hole yet, and there we go. So what's down here? Fake old skeleton. He's kind of pissed off too. He doesn't like visitors, as you can tell. So, you know how I said I was going to use Claymore? I lied. A very, very good weapon. I would even go as far to say it's one of the best weapons in the game as far as just overall utility. However, Plenty of weapons that can uh, beat it, but that all comes down to personal preference. So if you prefer one weapon or over another, then, you know, Great Scythe may not be as good as, say, as Vihander. But if you prefer something fast, you might prefer uh, a spear, you know. Due to the fact that this thing has a really long reach and it's uh, the right trigger attack, or if you're PlayStation uh, right or R2, you're gonna gonna like this weapon if you like the sweeping AOE attacks. Just look at that. It's like that's. I think it covers 190 degrees. It's pretty, pretty nice. Okay, I think I've already been down here. It's it's extremely good for a certain area of the game that where you can uh, rack up a ton of humanity. But 
but at the same time... I think it lacks damage, but damage shouldn't be the end-all be-all, you know? You could keep uh, enemies at, di at a distance for days with this thing. down here. Oh, yeah, right. I believe this is the Dark Moon Seance ring. As well as the giant skeleton. Yep. Okay. We can just avoid all these uh, guys. And run up here. I'm trying to piece everything to, together, like, where, where's what, sort of, you know. Okay. Tranquil walk of peace. Okay, so now we're back where we started. Looks like it. Yep. Ooh, heavy loss of frames right there. I swear, I do not know why I'm dropping frames like I am. It's really starting to bug me. <laughs> oh well. Shit happens, I suppose. So if we continue down here, we may recognize this place. But if we continue down here... And if we jump down here. Hello, friend. Heal up, just in case. I'm very confident with my uh, parries on a black knight. It's just... Sometimes I muck it up. Well, that wasn't very nice. Okay. Now, what I would do is I'd continue down there, keep running, and don't stop running. But what I have to do is I need to backtrack a little bit. That involves running for my life. Or, as some people call it, dying. <laughs> okay, that was, that was close. That was very close. Don't shoot me in the butt. I don't like being shot in the butt. Stop it. Okay, where are we? There should be a ladder up to... Oh, there we are. So, 
why am I making all these drops and why am I doing all this backtracking? Well, I was hoping you'd have the answer. But no, in uh, all seriousness. Uh, I swear I could turn, turn around in here all the time. Uh, nope, not supposed to go that close. So, there's a lot of stuff that you can only get from dropping down and all that good stuff. And I'm trying to just get the, like, the good stuff. But of course, I completely... Stop that, please. Okay. So, Paladin Leroy here is a beast. And honestly, if you ask me, you're going to need him for this next uh, fight. I mean, <laughs> a summon unlike any other, really. He makes uh, Black Iron Darkest look like a joke. No, seriously though, he he does he's he's crazy strong. That weapon of his? Man, I'd like to have it. Makes mincemeat out of most enemies in this area. Plus his shield is pretty cool. Okay. There you are, Leroy. However, that thing requires like 50 strength to use. It's ridiculous. Alright, let's do this. So, a general strategy for this fight is I'm going to have to, I need to conserve my, uh, well not conserve, I need to just make liberal use of my Estus while Leroy uh, does all the damage. It's going to be a long fight, but as long as I've uh, leveled myself up adequately. I shouldn't have... Oh, I should have practiced my rolling for this fight. Because it's very, very, very difficult to avoid these decks. Shit. Uh, Leroy's not in here yet. I gotta... Oh, no. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Taking too much damage. Oh, gotta heal. Alright, that should be enough healing for now. Oh, shit, that was close. Used almost all... I used all my exes for that fight. That was hard. Oh. Oh, hey, my favorite mask. <laughs> I'm sorry, my second favorite. I actually really like using the mask of the child. It allows me to use uh, another shield. The my own discretion because it, it's basically a grass crest with it uh, recharging your stamina only it frees up your shield and as goofy as it looks I like it 